Okay, okay, hear me out. Aratake Ito with 4P Shimanawa's Reminiscence and R5 Katsugara Kiri Nagamasa. <laughs> hold up, hold up. Did you just double take? Am I seeing things? Alright, that was a little bit too much to start with. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, YouTube. It's a slime king to Jimmy Man. Welcome to another video. Let's let you guys breathe a bit before any of you shout copium. Let me explain. Katsugara Kiri Nagamasa increases elemental damage, makes you lose 3 energy, but gives energy back every 10 seconds every time you use a skill. So for an R5 Nagamasa, that is a whopping 15 energy generated. What use is this to Arataki Ito? Well, it has been well documented that because of Ito's high burst cost, you typically run him in mono geo or tri geo cores. But with the weapon, you're opening up his teams to be a lot more versatile in exchange for lesser damage on Ito. Let's cut to the chase. Is that worth it? Hell no. But is it fun? Hell yes. Let's get into it. So the first team it opens up is Ito Taser. With Katsugara Kirinagamasa and his usual husk set, energy won't be a goddamn problem for this comp as there is a plenty to go around. There's nothing special about this team however, but don't tell me you didn't take a second look as you're seeing it now in action. In theory, Ito makes for a decent driver of Taser as he weaves in normal and charged attacks making it very easy to proc both Beidou and Sincho Bursts. Next up is Ito National. Again, for the same reasons as stated above, this team has no problems with energy gen and is straight up just so interesting and goddamn fun to watch that you have to try it out for yourself. Now, don't get me wrong, these are not optimal teams, but this just highlights that with just one weapon with very niche effects, it can change the very teams that you can build around the self-proclaimed leader of the Rataki gang. In terms of variations and versatility, with Katsugara Kirinagamasa Ito, the sky's the limit. If you enjoy playing random teams and be surprised it randomly works, these teams are surely for you. Now, let's take it to a whole nother level. Let's equip Ito with the 4P Shimanawa set. Now with this set equipped, rotations are going to get tighter as you lose 15 energy every time you use a skill and get that back with Katsugara Kirinagamasa. This means that you'd need more ER or more ER generated by your team. For Ito Taser, that is not a problem, as both Fischl and Beidou with Electro Resonance provides energy, and the results of this team might surprise you. <laughs> okay, I lied. It's pretty bad. But the sheer concept of it working out in terms of energy and rotations is so novel, plus not to mention that Katsugara Kirinagamasa has drip that only rivals the Red Horn Stone Thresher. If you're an aesthetics man like myself, this is a fucking W. So, what's the TLDR? Katsugara Kirinagamasa is a pretty bad weapon choice for Ito. 4P Shimenawa is a pretty bad artifact choice for Ito. But it works! That was the entire premise behind this video. Occasionally I find some bad shit crazy comp that has no right to work, but it does. Sometimes it's good, like Shao National teams. Most times, it's Shimenawa Ito, where it is absolute dog shit. <laughs> Let me know down in the comments below if you actually use this team despite the lim knowing their limitations now. I'm generally interested to know, or better yet, come at me at twitch.tv slash dojima man where I stream Genshin almost every goddamn day. That's been the video boys. As always, this is our parting. Farewell.